Welcome back to another video. Today we're back for another Champions League match day vlog and today we're playing Frankfurt at home. It's our third game in the group. We're sitting second currently and we need to be winning today because if we don't, we put ourselves in a very difficult position with the last two games. In the away game against Frankfurt, they made it difficult for us. We created a lot of chances. We should have won the game, but they grinded out a nil-nil draw. Like I said, we played well against Frankfurt and we played really well against Brighton on the weekend. So hopefully we can continue that run of form through to the game today. We're the best team in the group. We should be finishing top of Group D. We play well in the Champions League at home, so hopefully we can continue that today. Keep a clean sheet. I'm going to go for a 2 0 score prediction. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe down below with post notifications. Let's head up to Tottenham for another Champions League night. Come on, first. Richarlison has found himself back in the starting 11. Hopefully, he plays how he did against Marseille in the first Champions League game at home. We're also playing a different formation to how we did against Brighton. We're playing two in the midfield and we're pushing three up front, that being Sun, Richarlison and Kane. We should have a lot of firepower going forward. Hopefully, we can get the early goal, hit them on the counter attack and win by a few goals today. We should be getting the three points. Absolutely resilient in the final third. We went 1-0 down, like I said. But whenever Sonny's through, you have so much confidence in him, particularly on a one-on-one. -on -one. He's only had three shots on target, and two of them have gone in, and the third one was a great save from Kevin Trapp. We're clearly showing and proving that we're the much better team today. Marseille are currently beating Sporting 2-0 as well. So if it stays like this, we'll be top of Group D. We need to push, continue with this, get a couple goals in the second half, because I know we can, and get the three points. Come on, Spurs. Red for 
Frankfurt, they're down to 10 men within 60 minutes. I know they got a yellow. I don't know what exactly happened. There was a couple of bad challenges in Sunny. And they were talking to the ref and he's given a red. So Frankfurt are going to really struggle now, especially if we leave three up top. Oh, Sam. Sunny with the shoot. Oh, oh. 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 with four minutes to go. We're going to cruise control. We can see it evolve. We're still winning, but we should be winning this game way more comfortably. We're getting too relaxed. <laughs> Brian Gill off the bench. Way too silky for them. They're just pitting legs and left right and We're in the box. Second pen of the game. Harry Kane to the step up to get his brace. Coming for us. Let's finish this game. The second pen of the game. They... Oh! Second penalty miss of the season. First year win for Norman Forest, and that wasn't even close. I don't know if he scuffed it or what. Tries to go the opposite way to his other pen. Miles by the guy. Frank Gill back post! Oh, it's just low. No! Come on, yeah! Wow, yes, guys, another massive three points in the Champions League. The first two home games, and we won them both. I was going to say what a second half performance that was, but in the end we started to get really sloppy and complacent. Obviously Frankfurt got the red card in the 60th minute, we putting them down to 10 men. We made a lot of substitutions, went into cruise control and we were a lot more comfortable. We were holding possession, but we were giving away a few more sloppy mistakes. Obviously they got that second goal right at the end. Harry Kane had the penalty opportunity up the other end and he absolutely skied it. I'm not sure what happened there, but the main thing is we are now top of Group D. Marseille beat Sport in Lisbon 2-0, putting us on top now. I'm really happy with the performance nonetheless. So we go again on Saturday here against Everton. If you don't want to miss out on the vlog, make sure you subscribe down below, post notifications, drop a like on this video. Till the next one.